This is a classic case presentation of a minimally invasive lumbar spine surgery I performed just a couple months ago. In this case, it's a 68 year old male. He has severe radiculopathy, that means shooting pain down the legs, left worse than the right side. I'm gonna use this 3D printed cage to restore his disc height, take the pressure off the nerves and restore function. These are his preoperative films. You can see that L3 is crushing L4. There's no disc space left and when he leans forward, there's complete shifting or a disc slip of the bone. Well, this severely pinches the nerves in the back. This MRI will show how looking down the canal, there's severe stenosis at L3, L4. The foramen where the nerve tunnels come out are severely tight. He's sick of having injections and sick of taking medications. In the OR, we have all of our equipment from Camber Spine set up and ready to go. The minimally invasive technique I use is called an OLIF. You actually go through the patient's left flank to get to this disc space. By going through the flank, I go through so many less muscles than the back, and this is a much less painful surgery. The red arrow shows where the nerve was crushed. The green arrow shows where I've opened it up wide. By placing the cage here, it holds that open. This is a 3D printed cage I fill with the patient's own bone, and I reduce the spine back in the correct position. This minimally invasive technique lets the patient go home that day or the next day. Additionally, the fusion and screws help keep this nerve tunnel open so the patient does not have a repeat collapse of this nerve space. 